So when I got this at Goodwill a few days ago, the tape player was really boggy. It would it bogged down like, and it wouldn't play a tape unless I held down the pause a little bit to let off pressure off of the capstan wheel and the pinch roller. Um, obviously, that ind indicates it's a very worn out, loose belt, which in fact it was because I ended up replacing the belt and it works fine. Uh, the only problem is uh, the record, the board that's used to send audio to the playhead when you hit record. I don't know if the people who own this ever used the record function because this seems to me like it was that portion was never never used so it was very very temperamental and it's not even worth keeping a recording with this thing if you are to record because first of all hey hey fucking touchy switch <laughs> okay so I have a tape in here just to show that it does play normally. This tape right here, I gotta fast forward a little bit because I recorded over a little bit with something different, but actually, the fast forward function still doesn't want to work because there's one belt that still needs to be replaced and I haven't gotten to that one. But the rewind works, so I'm just gonna flip it over and rewind. Um, so I gotta fast rewind or fast forward slash rewind because I have the tape in the other direction <laughs> to the spot I need to. And uh, yeah, listen to how this thing records if I'm even. Nope, I'm not, I'm not at the part yet, so hold on. I'll get back to you. Alright, now, the song I played, the song clip I played were from this tape just a second ago. This is the same song recorded with this machine from CD. Listen to how bad this is. You really can't hear any music, it's all static. So, yeah. And it's not the speakers, it's not the board that controls the speakers. It's literally just when you record. It sounds like static when you turn knobs and it's all staticky and bullshit because of dirty potentiometers and all that crap. Yeah, that's basically what it is. So, this thing unfortunately cannot record with shit. There was a spot, however, where the static stopped and it kind of like kicked into normal gear for just for like a 10, 20 seconds. And the recording actually sounded very, very good for such a little size unit. But then the whole static and crap kicked back in. So there's something wrong with the record board on this thing, which is too, too bad because this is a nice little system and I really wish it would record properly. So other than that, I don't really know how to fix that problem, so see you later. <laughs>